Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm just doing a super quick haul, and I went to Sephora, or not Sephora's, <laughs> I went to Ulta. <laughs> Normally I go to Sephora's because, um, I don't know, just because. <laughs> when I lived in a different town, I didn't have a Sephora or an Ulta anywhere near me. You had to really travel to get to Sephora, and um, that's why I always use MAC, because MAC was very close to me. I was like extremely addicted to MAC makeup and that's all I use. Um, so now where I live now, there's a Sephora and an Ulta and they're literally kind of just like across the street from each other. The Sephora is a little bit closer but they're basically like right next to each other. So for some reason I always end up going to Sephora's, I guess because it's in an outside like mall thing so there's all kinds of other stuff to like, you know, go shopping at and whatnot. And I didn't really know like how great um, Ulta really was. So I finally went there and it's huge. It's way bigger than my Sephora. There is like way more stuff. I just, I was like in love. This store is huge. They have everything. I definitely, definitely, definitely will be going here a lot more often because it's just like amazing. Like I can't believe how like great this store is and I've lived here for three years and I have not walked into this store yet. So, I have to thank my hubby for that because he's the one that actually um, pulled in and was like, let's go in because I know you've been wanting to. So, um, I didn't get much, but I had grabbed this um, sexy hair, and this is straight sexy hair, smooth and seal. It's my kitty. And um, I guess it's supposed to be like really good for like flattening your hair and stuff. I use it today and I don't like the smell of it I don't know it's supposed to like control frizz and everything it seems to work fine but um I don't really like the smell of it I would much rather prefer the Paul Mitchell hot off the press which I've tried to find this like everywhere lately um because my sister-in-law got this I think at the Cosmo store and I just figured they would have it like at Ulta or something and where else? There was somewhere else I um I tried looking. I cannot find this product. And I absolutely love this product and I love the smell of it. So I'm gonna have to like start looking for that. But this one is I mean I've only used this once, so I can't say like I totally hate this product. I've heard like really great reviews on it. I just I don't personally like the smell too much myself. Um the other thing that I got was the Healthy Sexy Hair, and this is the Soy, and um, this is just like a leave-in, a spray leave-in treatment, and this stuff does smell really nice. This is a really good one. I would definitely probably buy a big bottle of this. Um, I've only used this a few times. It's got soy and cocoa. Um, I've used it on my girl's hair a few times, too. So, this stuff is really nice. Um, and then I got the the NYX Jumbo Pencils. I've never used NYX products ever before in my life. So this is a first for me. So these were the two that I wanted to start off with was the Black Bean and the Milk. And I like them so far. I've been using them um, the past few days. This, I love how creamy it is and like it's so like nice and black to like line my lids with. And then I usually just take like MAC Carbon and press that on to just kind of like keep it there. This, I don't know if it's because of the paint pot that I use. I use the MAC um, Bear Study, the paint pot, um, because that stuff, like, dries super quickly that when I go to put this on, it's like I can't smear it onto my, it's really hard to, like, get onto my eyelid. So let me know if, you know, that happens to you guys, because everyone loves this stuff. Like, I see everybody using it, it seems to be like one of the best things that everybody ever uses it and so far I'm like it's not that great to me because if I use it just on my bare skin it'll like smooth nicely but on the primer it doesn't so maybe I'll try my um maybe I'll try my Too Faced shadow insurance with this or um the elf one or something I'll try a different one and see if it goes on smoother and then the other thing I got that is super, super exciting, and I don't know if I tried saving the box. I'm not sure if I threw it out now. I got this straightening iron. It is so freaking cute. I broke my other one. I don't know where I put it. My other one, it cracked. Like the, um, 
the ceramic when I dropped it on the floor it cracked so I was really upset I really wanted a new one I was looking at Sally's but they're so expensive straightening irons are really really expensive and I just didn't have the money so I was like oh I'm probably not gonna get one for quite some time so anyways this is a Wigo and I absolutely love it so far it goes up to 430 which is super super hot I think I used it today and I used it around like the 380 between like the 380 and the 330 ish um, I was using it on my hair and so this was it said that it retailed for $79.99 it said that the Ulta's price was $34.99 and I got it on clearance for $6 99 yes 699 I was oh my god I was so freaking excited because I honestly didn't think I was getting a straightened iron for a long time to like Christmas you know and 699 I was like holy crap so I definitely you know grabbed this so I basically for all the products that I got I spent like 29 bucks so I spent less money on my whole purchase than what this straightening iron would have been so I'm super, super excited about it, and it's zebra, so it's super cute, and it's got the hot pink, and it's definitely me, and it's really adorable. So, and so far, I'm, like, loving it. I've used it a couple times, and I absolutely love it. So that's just my little haul. I hope you guys like it. Have a great day. Bye.